Hi, sweetie, I'm home. Oh my god, what's happened here? Oh, I totally forgot. I just came back from my date with Jay. Oh, great, you're home. What took you so long anyway? Of course, I'm packing for a new apartment that we're we're unpacking in a new apartment and we and Jordan right Jordan we didn't know what to do it's okay okay I'm gonna jo Jordan come by I just need to speak to you <sighs> oh, oh I mean what's your pony doing here there you go sweetie right um so I just been on a date with Jake and I wanted to you know come here your mom our mom wants to speak to us oh, like ever oh sorry that was mine <sighs> never mind so what's the problem I don't want to speak to you either you cheated on that how can you say all this you don't even know Jake, look, he was my high school sweetheart, well, sort of, high school sweetheart, we were actually sweethearts in uni, we met in university, um, we weren't on the same course, we just did this uh, training together, mental health training, and I sort of had a fling with him back then, um, however, your grandfather didn't approve of it, he wanted me to marry your father. Well, I'm sorry. Just felt so. I feel like our family was falling apart and everything. I liked it when we were a happy family. Were we ever a happy family, Mom? No, listen. Listen. Both of you, you're my babies. You're st even at whatever age you are, even if you're old enough will still be my babies okay i i am really sorry i messed up at this one and i'm not regretting marrying a father because he gave me you two and i don't regret any of you being born i love you too you're my babies and you will always be my babies even if you're not jake's but what you gotta understand is yes i messed up by marrying your father and not really being strong enough to stand up to my father but I wouldn't have it any other way because if I didn't marry your father I wouldn't have you two and I don't want that to think that way yes it would be lovely to have kids with Jig with like I dreamed but sometimes the harsh reality truth of reality is that you can't always have things. Remember how I told you can't have everything you want? That was just like with me and Jake. I truly wanted Jake, but then I felt like, well, maybe your father was the right man, but then... Just these feelings from Jake came up whilst every time, you know, your father went out, I just felt so alone. Um... And uh, the only thing that really stopped me was going to work or just spending time with you two. Um, Jake has proposed to me on our romantic picnic. However, I just wanted to confirm with you guys. <laughs> That's really amazing. And I do have to apologize to you two. As I mentioned, you are my babies and uh, you do not deserve to know that I've not being loyal to your father and your father hasn't been loyal to you this has nothing to, with, to do with you too you're amazing please don't ever think that way and Jake has asked me if you if it would be okay to have kind of like a family dinner like um he wants to invite us or something to this family dinner engaged he Jake has proposed to you oh, this is so sweet um of course, and um, we will go to that family dinner that you mentioned earlier. 
Because I don't mind. Right? What do you think, Jordan? Yay! See? Jordan doesn't mind either. But I'm just... I'm really sad what's going to happen with Dad.